Hello guys, karon na na get medyo of City Hall ni Joby Lord. Ug ang akong time is 12:25 so lunch break. So nagbuhat lang mi dere gawas. So mao na siya ay Republic. Hello everyone, this is Vixon. Welcome to my channel and thank you so much for tuning in. Karon mang lakaw na pod min Joby Lord mo adto mi og City Hall. Hey jo. Wag lisay. Lisay ko na siya. So, diha may nag-stay sa horizon ay. O na, horizon. Kadang na ay green. Ninth floor na diha. Na diha ang swimming pool. So, doha siya ka tower. Ang naa sa left side, mao na ang tower 2. Tower Kaning mas taas, tower 1. Hello guys, karon na na get medyo of City Hall ni Joby Lord. Ug ang akong time is 12:25 so lunch break. So nagbuhat lang mi dere gawas. So mao na siya ay Republic Office is a public trust City Hall of Cebu ni siya. Dugay dugay sad mi nagbuhat sa taxi about 1 hour gyud. Hey Joe. First time na ko na kaano ba ok City Hall si Bo. So Tara, tapong layo ang City Hall. So hopefully makuha na mo karon ang among kuan. Amo ni i-submit ang among kuan health certificate for travel. Dinana na pud mi certificate sa from barangay certificate. Makuha na sad mi og health certificate. So from there magkuan pa mi amo pang i-submit diri after pirmahan pa daw kuno ni mayor. So amo pang i-submit diri ana sad. So, mong naa na mi dire kay pagka human dire ah, maadto pa mo good me o ko ana po police police station para makuha na mi among travel authority kay ang police station may mo release sa travel authority. Sana na ako ani ha asim baha o isam na nga building siyang building I don't know what the building is that ay ang Santi Nuno manday na dyan no simbahan sa Santi Nuno Santo Nuno Shrine of Cebu excuse me manday na siya nakaanahan naman ko Santo Nuno so wak ko nakadini ah dito na ko sa front dude Simba, so what kind of name are they for you? I'm pretty cool.
guys, I wasn't able to vlog inside the city hall because taking videos are not allowed. When I was inside, I found out that they don't accept any walk-ins. They only accept documents from government in charge like barangay secretaries. So, they, they said that we can submit our documents, you know, the certificates, the barangay certificates, and the health certificate online. So, they give us an email ad where to send them. So, after City Hall, Juvelord or Junkon TV and I decided to go to Cologne Street and had some shopping there. We walked for about 10 minutes from City Hall to Cologne. It was fun though. I had a good time roaming around um, Cologne but I did not take any videos there because for me it's not safe roaming around Cologne using camera or even cell phone and I want to enjoy shopping. I really like every time I have a vacation here in the Philippines I really like going to Cologne because I just enjoy it. There's a lot of uh, stuff that you can buy and less um, less prices than going to the big malls here in Cebu City. Probably we spent three hours roaming around Cologne and before we decided to leave, I get a bucket of fried chicken from Jollibee for our dinner. And oh my gosh, we wait and wait for a taxi for us to ride back to Horizon 101 condominium where we stay but we cannot get any taxi. I felt tired and stressed after more than an hour of waiting for a taxi but we can't find any we even um transferring different locations just to get taxi but we got nothing all the taxes were occupied so jubilord told me that until let's just uh, start walking from Cologne to Winter circle so now we're here at the intersection Turning right is the Del Rosario Street, but we're going straight to Fuente Osmeña Circle. Then from Fuente Osmeña Circle to Horizon 101 Condominium at General Maxellum Avenue. So, still walking and just enjoying the view this is my very first time walking down here though hopefully we'll see a vacant taxi for us to ride so that we don't have to walk I'm hoping we can get taxi you know while walking here at Osmania to our condominium Now from here we still have one kilometer or 0.62 mile to walk. So we'll just walk straight until we reach Fuente Osmeña Circle. Look at Jove Lord guys. I really enjoyed watching him playing the circles for you know for people for social distancing <laughs> look at him oh gosh he just parang dinadala na lang namin to sa laro na lang yung pag lalakad namin kasi it's very tiring na but yeah still surviving
up guys i did not know that the cebu normal university is located here at osmania boulevard oh well this is my very first time walking this area so now i know Across the street, that blue building, there is the police station too. We went there once though. They told us that they don't accept barangay certificate and health certificate only. We still need certificate from the mayor, signed by the mayor, and then from the mayor to, you know, that police station there. So that's why we went to City Hall today to get the certificate from the mayor but sad to say hindi nangyari ang gusto namin kasi nga they don't accept any walk-ins here at Osmania Boulevard you'll see also the Camp Sergio Osmania Senior Police Regional Office 7 so yeah it's located here Gosh, finally we're here at Fuente Circle. I 
as you can see, lots of motorcycles and bicycles parked here because uh, for three months there was no public transportation and even now public transportations are back but still it's not 100% that's why we're walking on my right side is a uh, Robinson Fuente Mall. So Robinson Fuente Mall is only walking uh, distance from condominium that we stayed in. So now from here at Robinson Fuente to Horizon 101, it's only 450 meters away or 492.126 yards or 6, min six minutes away you know, to walk depending on your speed. Finally, I'm almost there. If I just only knew that um, we can't ride a taxi, I won't buy a bucket of fried chicken. The Jollibee here is close to our condominium, see? But, oh well, it's done and we're almost there. So, we're gonna have uh, our dinner ready anyway. So, we'll, all we have to do just put this in a microwave and... We heat and eat and rest. Here's the Korean restaurant. I haven't been there though, even before lockdown. It's just because I'm not a fan of Korean food. Well, I just want to enjoy Filipino food while I'm here in the Philippines. So that's why I still like my um, native food. On my right is Mango Avenue and they have the famous Mang Inasal and Chowking fast food here. this area though you know this area here because you can feel the breeze from the ocean it's nice oh god thank you lord i did survive from long walk even my feet is hurt it's just because i have my sandal on not a walking shoes but thanks god we got here sound and safe thank you lord and now i have to return this quarantine pass and go upstairs so guys i'm done returning my quarantine pass And now I'm here, so I'm going up to 49th floor where our unit and yeah, that was my vlog for today and thank you so much for walking with me. Thank you so much for watching. 
and please don't forget to like share and comment below and if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please click the red button below and ring the bell for more updates from me thank you bye bye see you later